don't want to be whatever his initial stand for. <laughs> I, this is, I'm glad that Bob's not here because we wouldn't have made it to the finals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But to be playing an opponent using the handle, a cute little, little girl, girl, and not having Bob here. It's sort of sad. Oh, well. Yeah. Because any... How would... How would I, I, I'm curious. I agree. <laughs> how would Bob have caused us to lose the last match? What well... Would, what would Bob we, have we would We wouldn't have won the first. Okay, yeah, yeah. I mean, we never would have made it to that round two that we just had the blowout, because in that long game, somehow he would have influenced us to lose. No, it seems... It, I mean, I... Like I said, I'm not fighting you on it. I think you're right. Okay, okay. White so far. I'm not yep. liking that. Wait, no, wait. I am like. Yes. I don't know what I like. Uh, I'm, I like I'm liking it. White says to me, like, probably heroic. Yeah, heroic. Probably, probably not monstrous, except for that hundred handed dude. Is this thing. I mean, is that a thing? Do people really play this card? That's our second opponent in a row who's had it. And... It's a 1 3 for 2. With a an ability which isn't awful that can gain life, but I don't know. In a heroic deck, if I'm targeting that card with my spell, then you feel my like deck's losing. not working. Yeah. Well, yeah, but it gives you a little bit more time for your deck to start. In a one three, I mean that. Yeah, I probably am not thinking, looking at it the right way. There's a defensive aspect to it that. I'm not appreciating. Well, and any time that you have a fat ass, there's sort of an offensive side of it as well, just because you say, yeah, you don't have anything that can kill it. I'll run in. Right. You have a bunch of 1-1s. One okay. Or I'll sit back and let you run into me. But. Next up. Nothing. Stupid. Did you figure it out? I think I don't do anything for the rest of the game. <laughs> have, you, have you killed my one four yet? No. <laughs> I need to just pink you until you die. Ooh, black white mirror. No. We did not play a silent artisan. <laughs> yeah. We have standards. Okay. I'm willing to go for it. If he doesn't just kill it this turn... And we get the life linker guy on it. It'll be a, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have a last breath of your own. Mm, no, much worse. So we need one of our sip of hemlocks. Don't we have one of those death touchy dudes? Uh, we have the giant death touchy dude. Okay. Yeah, I'm not terribly concerned about it unless he kills this, because we'll be gaining quite a lot of life. Yeah. And then we can start gaining life from that thing too. Sure. Oh man, we're beating up a cute little girl. <laughs> we're trying to. Five, seven. Hmm. Oh, you know what you want to do. Put this on that? Yeah. yeah I 
do. <laughs> I mean, the only thing I wish is that you could put it on the enchantment instead. <laughs> so, so that if it dies, yeah, it would you'd stay still there. get it. <laughs> that would be extra amazing. Okay, I'll swing with this guy too. So we'll force him to discard two cards also. Which isn't... I mean, that ain't nothing. It went off already? Yeah, because he already had, had the plus one, one plus okay. one from that. <laughs> His thing is going to go off, so he's going to gain ten life. That's annoying. Yeah. But we're... If he doesn't kill one of our creatures right now, we're dealing eight, so... Not bad. And that ain't bad. <laughs> so don't have Divine Verdict. That's what I'm really scared about, because I know we passed some to take our Sip of Hemlocks. Yeah. What does Divine Verdict do? Destroy target attacking or blocking creature. Mm, yeah. And if he kills this guy, whoops, and that guy. Life then, is harder on us. Yes. Then we really need to draw that sip of hemlock to kill this guy. So he'll go up to 21. We'll go down to 15. <coughs> he'll go down to 15. We'll go up to 21. Uh, and he's getting... Going even higher. Hmm. But he's de dealing eight, we're gaining six. So we're still winning that race. Hey, that was that card you were talking about. Yes, there it is. So you figure you'll just give up? I wouldn't be surprised if that was a reaction, but we'll find out. If he doesn't give up, that tells me he probably somewhere in his deck does have an answer for the Wing Steed Rider. Sure. I think it would be a good thing to last breath if he doesn't throw it right away. Yeah, it's too bad the Marauder doesn't just have Intimidate. <laughs> I mean, it's yes. like, it's all well and good when he comes into play that he does this. It's cool, but... Yeah, if, if he could... If he just had Intimidate as well, like, if you were... I mean, it wouldn't, wouldn't work now, but if it was even, like... If your Devotion to Black is at least four... Yeah. Then he has Intimidate. Yeah, I would accept some sort of trigger like that. Uh, Ray of Disillusion, yes. One fewer last breaths. I don't know, those guys are, a lot of his guys are pretty small. One fewer ordeals. I'm trying to think what. Like, if his guy gets large, then we're going to need the sips. Mm -hmm. Probably ordeal. We're not too terribly... I mean, we have the one wing steed rider, but other than that, we're a wait around and win deck, not a attack and win. Uh, he had to mulligan. It's always good. 
Our deck is not great. Our start is not great, but oh well. Yeah. See ya, planes, sometime soon. Then I'd be happy with the hand. Oh, wow, we can last breath the crap out of this guy if we get look at away. Sip of hemlock is probably a better card to pitch there, but it's our only answer for a few of his cards. Damn it. Oh, apparently the system didn't like us beating up on a cute little girl. And I see nothing wrong with that. This little girl had it coming. Nope. Huh. No need to even show you any more cards. Holy crap. Yeah. Well, we're playing 17 land. We shouldn't hit a run like that. Look like the first. I can live with that. Especially if he doesn't have something to interrupt the combo. Sure. Although I'm going from three last breaths to none. Some kind of I don't know. I'll take no last breaths in hand to three last breaths in hand and never <laughs> being able to cast them. Yes. The distinct lack of planes was painful. So do I tempt fate and wait for him to cast something on it and then kill it? Knowing that he might have a second thing? Yeah. I don't know that you dick with a flyer, man. Fair. I mean, there's a lot of cards where it's like, yeah, whatever. But. Yeah, we'll take a chance on it, but not on that. But there's, but if it doesn't work, the thing blows up like a balloon all of a sudden, and you got a zeppelin. It's, wait, <laughs> I know you. Uh, so I can put the triad out. Power on him attack. <coughs> Probably triads better for long run.
Don't make the fates cut a bitch. <laughs> and really, no, yeah. It's not exactly what I want, but with the sip of hemlock one land away, I can live with it. Sure. What's next? I'm not clear where you're going with this. I just wanted to have two more. So then you're going to put a token on his Wingsteed Rider. And then potentially I could exile it and let him have two cards. Right. I mean, you obviously don't really want to give him two cards. Right. But... But are those two cards going to be better than a kind of buffed up... Yeah, than a 5-5 five, five Vigilant Flyer? Probably not. Yeah. I mean, long term, maybe, but unless he can kill that guy, we just keep doing it. Yeah, draw your cards. We'll mill you with it. <laughs> so what do you cast? And, like, if he had Sip of Hemlock targeted this guy and then we were able to draw into ours and he didn't have something to sit back and protect it. And he still has up what could be God's willing. <coughs> and this thing I almost want to kill before it gets regeneration. Yeah, yeah. So I'm probably going to have to exile that when I get a chance. Good thing we have the Grey Merchant to gain back some life. So we are going to be pretty low. Yeah. yeah. Well, evasion, man. Uh, that's annoying. So we really need our other sip of hemlock. Let's see, sip of hemlock would do it. Uh, our Gorgon chick would be too slow. Um, Ray of Dissolution would at least help. Put this on this and attack. I want block. I'll be blocking that with that.
What is that? Holy crap. Yeah. Let's see. So probably I want to play this out. And then just text with everything you get there. I guess I could try last breathing one of my own creatures to gain full life. Yeah. <coughs> But this thing is just going to get there anyway. Let's wait and see what. No, I really need one, a, a few of those minus four, minus four things as an intermediary for bigger than last breath, smaller than really needs a sip of hemlock. <laughs> Let's do it! Let's see, so he's dealing eight by gain four. I'll be at ten. And then we go down to two. Right. It gives us a draw. Yeah. I think that's the best we can. Go with. Or does it? It does. Okay. All right. Well, that was uh, that was the end of that then. Yeah. Maybe he'll not block. Misclick. Misclick. We lost to a cute little girl. That's unfortunate. Oh well, these yes. things happen. The deck that honestly did better than I expected it to. Yeah, I'm not complaining about how that all went. All right, well, so. Maybe would have been better off killing the Wingsteed with a sip of Hemlock. Um, I don't know. Yeah, flyers were a problem. Right. They just he, he played two of them. The other one was going to regenerate. Yeah. Oh, well. We got the packs back and then one. Well, and that thing we killed that could regenerate was also a flyer. Right. So, I mean, it's like you'd... Yeah, it would have been grand less damage, damage, but it, we would never have been able to stop it. Yeah. Okay. Hooray for us. Yeah. <laughs> See you next time.